Hi everyone, this is Dr. Jyoti Bala. I welcome you all on my YouTube channel. I hope you all are doing great. As you know, virology and virus research is a significant subject where most of the biology student and biotech student want to enter. I myself has my virology research experience from India, Japan and USA. I have worked on influenza virus, measles virus and HIV virus. So let's explore five significant viruses which are quite challenging to tackle with. As we know, viruses can't replicate on their own. They need host system. There are various factors which makes virus research a challenge challenging area. Viruses can't replicate on their own. They need host system. Additionally, viruses are highly diverse and dynamic. The various type of viruses with their unique genetic makeups and property, this diversity actually makes it challenging for researchers to develop diagnostic treatment and vaccines against these viruses. Viruses also has this capability to quickly evolve and mutate which means new strain can emerge that could be resistant to the existing treatment and vaccine. This makes it difficult for researchers to keep up with the changes and develop new solutions. There is limited information about viruses. It is difficult to culture in the lab. We have to understand the viruses, its host pathogen interactions, thus to better understand how they infect, replicate and cause diseases. This lack of knowledge and challenges associated with its culture make it difficult for researchers to develop effective treatment and vaccine. Because viruses can't replicate, we need biological system where they can be replicated and thereby we can study their biology and behavior in the laboratory system. And virus related research are quite expensive and time consuming also. And for doing such kind of project, we require trained people in such areas. So let's see which are these top five viruses which are difficult to work on. The number one is HIV and we still doesn't have any vaccines against HIV. This is one of the biggest challenges associated with the HIV. I myself has worked on HIV in Florida International University, USA. Actually, HIV can quickly mutate and evolve. Does it make difficult for researchers to develop a treatment against them? They are also capable of uh, making latency and reservoir. Thus, they are also involved in chronic HIV AIDS. The another virus which is also quite uh, challenging is influenza virus. I myself has worked on influenza virus in Japan. It is also capable of mutating and evolving frequently, thus leading to the new strain that can evade the current vaccines and treatment. The another virus which is also very important is Ebola virus, which is highly contagious and can lead to fatal illness. One of the biggest challenges associated with the Ebola virus research is the lack of access to the virus in the laboratory. As I said, Ebola is highly contagious. Thus, a special labs are required if you want to enter and work in such areas. If you want to work on such areas, you need to work in the biosafety level BSL-4 laboratories. These are specialized facilities. BSL-4 labs are designed to protect the laboratory worker from any such infection. This kind of lab has positive air pressure to prevent contamination from outside lab, multiple layers of security to control the assist, specialized equipment and clothing to protect the worker from infection, decontamination process to prevent the spread of viruses, and advanced ventilation system to filter and exhaust the air from the lab. Hence, working in BSL-4 labs require money and also train workers and scientists. The another virus which is quite challenging, which I think all biologists and non-biologists are aware of SARS-CoV-2. We all have seen this COVID-19 period and we know the challenges associated with SARS-CoV-2. One of the biggest challenges associated with research related to SARS-CoV-2 is the speed at which the virus is spreading which make it difficult for researchers to study the virus in depth. So in SARS-CoV-2, we still have to address a many unsolved questions like we have to address about the long COVID and if they are making any reservoir. There are many unsolved areas which we need to still address. The another virus which is quite significant and challenging is Hepatitis C. This is also a challenging virus to research because they have complex genotypes. Hepatitis C can exist in multiple genotypes, each with distinct genetic characteristics. This makes it difficult for researchers to develop treatments and vaccines that can effectively target all the genotype of the viruses. It is also difficult to detect this virus, especially in the early stages of the infection, which make it difficult to study and diagnose this disease. 
There are also concerns related to resistance toward the drug. Hepatitis C can develop resistant to the antiviral drug, which make it difficult to cure the disease. This is why there is a lot of research which is ongoing on developing new drugs and combination therapy to deal with the drug resistance. So if you are interested in doing your research and you want to enter in such sector, so here is the list of top 10 global research center where you can work on virus related research. So you can uh, see these top 10 list of research centers which are working in the areas of virology. You can explore their websites and see different research groups who are working in the virology sectors and approach them and timely apply for those positions. Good luck from my side. I hope you have liked the session. Don't forget to like and subscribe the channel and do share these information among your scientific endeavor. And if you have any queries related to virus related research, you can approach me. Thank you.